<clears throat> I'm not going to call this a review. I'm going to call it a um, demo, a, a test. Uh, what it is, it's my um, MSR <clears throat> XGK EX stove. Um, and the idea is when we go out sort of uh, camping with myself or the wife or on my own with mates or whatever, uh, she's quite a, a loud beast. And the idea is I've actually purchased that I have in here, I think I have. That's the spares. I've actually purchased, I don't know if anybody's seen any of these. I don't know what you call it, whether it's to be called a silencer, uh, a damper cap. Uh, I'm not no, I'm not too sure. I mean, the manufacturer word for it is an XGA, it's a door, a, a door, D A W G. And the idea is that it actually quietens the stove down. You've probably heard one of these stoves going. So what I was going to do is a demo of the, the stove running at full power, as it is. And then I'll take out the deflector plate, which is just inside here, and I'll replace it with, I'm going to call this a, like the silencer, uh, and see how it runs. So if you'd like to stick with me, we'll have a bit of a, a, bit of a play. The fantastic stoves. I mean, a lot of, I don't know if you call it stealth camping or what, what you want to call it, but um, this thing, if you were stealth camping, you wouldn't, they would know you were there. <laughs> Absolutely, definitely. So I can't, I haven't done this for a long time, fitted this bottle, so I'm just going to make sure I get this right. That's the way. I think that's the way. Hold on one second. Bear with me, I've not, like I said, I've not used this for a while. Okay, so we've got to flick the arm back over the top. That's no, over that way. Am I being stupid here or what? That's right, so. Push home. And then clip. Okay. They are a bit, if you haven't used it for, like I said, for a while, they're not, um, in this regards, it keeps lifting it up as you can see anyway, but we'll get there, don't worry. <clears throat> Prime it a bit. I'm going to put in some, a little bit of fuel. Just till it, if you can see that, you just prime it till it just primes the dish at the bottom. That's it, turn him off. And then we ignite him. And the idea is once you ignite it, the flames will then heat up this expansion chamber if you can see that going over the top and then that will turn the liquid into gas so let that run for a while what I'm going to do as well once it's done, I'm going to boil a cup of water two cups of water in here see how long it takes to boil and then what I'll do we'll swap the cap over we'll cool everything down the kettle cool it down everything then we'll time it again and then see what happens I like the stove that's why I bought this this was quite expensive actually I'm not going to say how much. But there. Yeah. You can see it's now starting to gas. Oh. I'll just not burn any more excess off.
quite noisy, as you can guess. I guess, as you can hear. So I'll put two cups of water in this, and then we'll do a boil test. So two cups of water. Suffer, I will come back in a second. So one minute twenty-two. And we'll just check. Starting to bubble a bit. Like the center cap off, you can see that. I'm not going to touch it. You see, this cap will come off here, and now we'll exchange it for this, and then we'll see how quieter it is. Okay, so that's the kettle cooled down, cold water, very cold water. So make sure the test is the same. Stove's a little bit hot, I'm just going to remove the it does get hot this thing. Now we're going to fit what we call the damper or whatever and you can line these up so that these spaces on each side line up with the legs so there's less heat penetrating the legs just go oh, by me that's right okay i'll just turn around okay So I reset the stopwatch to zero. I'm going to prime this. It probably gets hot enough, but I'll probably prime it any. Was it worth the money? Don't know. But definitely a lot quieter. Okay. 
so it's up to temperature. So I'll put the kettle on. And away we go. So the idea of the test is once you put the silencer cap on, um, whether it is a sufficient with or without. So the boil time of the last one, let's say was um, 2 minutes 35, 2 minutes 40. So we'll see what this is. So like I said, I'm not going to let you watch it all. So we're at 22 seconds at the moment. So I'll get back. It's running very nicely. with the foreman in the bottom. And that's now at the moment at 150. Okay, that's two minutes twenty-three. Let's just check. Yeah. That. It's going to boil now. Two minutes fifty. So it does affect, sorry about that, it does affect it slightly by a little bit by I'd probably say close on a minute in a minute, it doesn't it is quieter. Yep, here we come. I would say about a minute difference in boil time. It's not a biggie, I just wanted to know what difference it does make, you know. So, yeah, I mean, we're coming to a rolling boil now. Yeah, so it's definitely a minute difference. Oh well. So that's the test with and without, I'm going to call it the silencer cap. Um, probably a bit more of it, but that's a, that's a full rolling boil now. So, yeah, take him off. It is quieter. A bit of an awkward thing to fit, I must admit, but it's running. Yes. I'll probably use it with it. Um, oh, well, I start the test. I hope you enjoyed the video. If you did, if you like to do thumbs up. Um, any comments down below, that's fine. Um, and thanks for watching. And I'll just turn it off. You can see what she's like. That's a bit quieter. They do take a little bit of going out these but I'm impressed with it. It's good. Yeah so yeah thank you very much for watching and um, we'll catch you in the next vid. Cheers. Take care.